In this guide, I'm going to show you how you can open up multiple Roblox accounts at the exact same time here on PC. This method is super easy, completely free, and only takes a couple of minutes to get set up. But before we get into this guide, make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel with all notifications on. It really does help the channel and lets us know that you want more content like this. We'd greatly appreciate it. And if at any point through this guide, you do have any questions, just ask them down in the comment section below and we can help you out further. I'm going to be doing my best to reply to every single comment down there. First things first, if you do have Roblox open up, go ahead and exit out of it because you're going to want to open up Google first and search for Process Explorer by Microsoft hit enter it's going to take you to a page that looks like this and you're looking for this top option right here select it and you're going to see a tab that looks something like this from here go ahead and select download process explorer and it's going to put a zip file right here i would just recommend dragging this onto your desktop it'll make your life a lot easier in a minute and then just extract it while you're at it just by right clicking on it and then hitting extract all hit extract and it's going to take all of these extra files right here and just put them in a separate folder that looks something like this from here open up this new folder and what you're looking for is this proc exp file just like so go ahead and right click on it and then select run as administrator hit yes hit agree and then from here it's going to open up a page that looks something like this and i know it can look a little bit complicating don't worry i'm going to walk you through this entire process up in the top right go ahead and select filter by name and type in roblox and then from here go ahead and hit enter if you don't see roblox when you do search it up just make sure that you go ahead and open up the roblox launcher first i'm just going to keep mine off to the side so that you can see that it's open once you select Roblox, go up to view and then go down to this little option that says lower pane view, select threads, and it's going to show you a page that looks like this. Then reselect Roblox player and you're going to see all these options on here that are saying waiting. I'm going to expand this so it's a little bit easier to see, but what you're looking for in here is going to be an option that says Roblox singleton events now what i would recommend doing is just filtering this to the handle section right here and you'll see this a lot easier as you can see it's right here for you so you don't have to scroll through all this threads options but this is what you're looking for right here right click on it and then hit close handle and then hit yes just like so as soon as you do that roblox is going to no longer block multiple instances so you just need to simply log into your alt account launch roblox again and you'll be able to play on two accounts at the exact same time so as you can see, I can open up this just like so, and then I can go ahead and sign out of this account by selecting more, going to the very bottom, hitting log out. As you can see, I now have both my accounts signed in and I can go ahead and get into the same match. For example, we can go ahead and get into, I don't know, the forge, right? And I can essentially play both of these at the exact same time in the exact same lobby if I wanted to. It really is as simple as that. If you guys did have any questions, just ask them down in the comment section below and we can help you out further. I'm going to be doing my best to reply to every single comment down there. Oh, look, I actually got in the same lobby as myself too. That's crazy. Have a great rest of your day though. Peace.